Well, it's, it's Monday morning here in the goat shed, and we're back at it for the next week. What we wanted to show you today, and it's here it is, that's the drive pull off that magnetron we're working on. I think everyone can see that big groove in it. It's obviously not supposed to be there. Uh, that's the worst one I've ever seen. Often you can dremel down the edge and uh, fix that, but we've actually had to replace that. Subsequently, we look very closely at the wheel, the escapement wheel. It's going to be really hard to show you this, I think, but that one there that's marked with the yellow, yeah, it's probably not going to come up real good, but that tooth is almost flat along with a few others. So the potential to skip a tooth was too great, and we decided to change both the escapement wheel and the drive arm pull. Fortunately, we had some of those. We can put that wheel into, a say, a 0 to 9 unit. We'll file it, and we've done that before. And, um, you know, a one-way step, a 0 to 9 unit, wouldn't matter if it skipped a tooth. But, yeah, on a player unit, it's, it's essential. You might recall we showed... Um, the score rail frame that was in the vinegar bath in a previous video, well, there it is again. It's come out of the the vinegar bath and had a bit of a clean up. And, you know, it's quite acceptable now. It was terrible before. Both sides are done. So, there you go. Vinegar does work um, for all those naysayers. No need to use expensive products like Rust-Oleum. Pure white vinegar simply works. Okay, so that's all we've got for you from the Goat Shed this morning. This has been another Goat Shed presentation.